Hello, this is Joshua for Frost Dragon Designs, and today I'd like to talk to you about my Pancake Butter Cat Hard Enamel Pin. This is design number 17 for my Cute Cat Pin Club. Every month, members of the club will receive a brand new cute cat pin that I've designed. If you join the club before April 22nd, 2023, the first pin that you will receive is the Pancake Butter Cat. If you're interested in joining the club, there's a link in the description below. Now let's get into the design. Now you're probably looking at this right now and thinking, that doesn't look like pancakes. And that's because it wasn't. It started out originally as supposed to be a, a waffle pin. Um, but in the end, I chose not to do the waffles because it kind of, for some reason, suddenly reminded me of these kind of yellow foam food tray things that I remember from... Uh, from my childhood, from uh, school lunches that I just thought were completely gross. Uh, so I had to pivot away from this waffle concept. Uh, but I still wanted to do a butter cat on a breakfast food. And I was like, you know what? I love pancakes, so let's do pancakes. The actual cat for this design I've used in a number of pins. I, I took it specifically from the column cat pin, but this is the same cat that I've used on the pin that has the cat napping on a book and the cat napping on the laptop. It's the same cat I use. It's also actually, I think, the same cat that's been used in the ice cream cat pin. I like recycling the cats for these uh, because I feel it lends an extra layer of continuity between all the designs in the collection. So because of that, the cat was already designed. I just needed to change its color. And the pancakes and the plate, well, they're not terribly complicated either. I mean, they're, they're ellipses. They're ovals. Um, yes, I stacked them and I did a little bit of work there with them. But they're not terribly complicated either. I think what I found most enjoyable to do about this design, though, was actually the syrup. Because I wanted to make it feel like I was sitting down for a plate of pancakes that I just had poured way too much syrup on, and it was just, you know, cascading down from the top over the edges and then pulling around the pancakes on the plate. I know it's too much syrup, uh, but that's how I like to eat my pancakes. That's kind of the, the feeling I wanted people to have is, oh man, these are going to be some really sweet pancakes. I also decided to kind of have the butter cat melting a little bit into the syrup. I know, poor butter cat, but I really felt like that would help sell the fact that these are, are warm. These are hot. These are, you know, just freshly made pancakes, and that heat is causing the butter cat to melt just a little bit into the syrup. So while this was a fairly simple design to execute, I really love this one. I plan on wearing it out to breakfast over the weekend uh, or wearing it when I'm cooking pancakes in my house. So thank you so much for your time. Please be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.